I have not played this game in a long time. Now, I have played it quite a bit. As a matter of fact, I own more copies of this particular game than any other game out there. So, I was looking up... I, I, did, a, I did a YouTube playthrough series on my main channel at some point. I was looking up when that was, and apparently it was back in 2016. Now, for those of you wondering, 2016 was not like three years ago. It wasn't even four years ago. That's seven years ago, guys. Um, I did since buy the game on my phone, played it for a little bit on a flight, and then I realized, eh, playing games on a phone still kind of sucks. Then, I think I bought Loran a copy when we first started going out years and years ago. I think she has a Steam account, but I don't even know what computer she used to play on. Anyways, then at some point we we both got a Switch, and we did like a co-op playthrough. But in order to play the co-op version on the TV or whatever, we both needed to own a copy of the game on the Switch too. So I I basically what I'm getting at is I've bought more copies of Stardew Valley than I have any other game. Um, it's been a long time, however, since I last played it, and I kind of felt like playing. Uh, I was thinking right, like I was, I was thinking about different base builders and sandbox type of games, and I realized you know what. Stardew Valley is considered to be one of the best games of the last decade, I guess. Maybe one of the best games of all time. Maybe it's about time we jump back in. You have it on your phone, on Steam, and on your Switch? Right. Is this game better than Stray? It is 100 times better than Stray. Yes. Um, now, the developer of this particular game, and that is singular, it's one guy that apparently worked on at least the vast majority of this, which is insane. Um, I know he's coming out with a new game sometime this year. So maybe because of that, it's kind of been on my... Uh, at least I think it's supposed to come out sometime this year. I don't know. Um, but anyways, um, maybe that's the reason why it's been on my mind as well. So if I go to load over here, there are still a few playthroughs. I did that earlier today. Yeah, so this is probably my main playthrough from back in the day. Considering I own a farm that has 380,000 gold. Um, and I think that's 60 hours of playtime. Uh, that's, that's Loran's brother. I don't know why he's on my account. I have no idea. Prime Farm? Yeah, so I don't remember. I streamed this since 2016 at some point as well, but I don't remember when that was. Anyways, today I'm starting from scratch. Prime Farm is a good name though, not gonna lie. So I know they've done a lot of updates to this game as well since. Um, I, um, yeah, I, I don't really know exactly what's new. I know a lot of people suggested that I play this with mods. I have not installed any mods. But, um, I can probably install them later on if I want to. The pink cowboy hat was difficult to get, man. Don't, 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 you know. Don't make fun of my pink cowboy hat. Do I plan on doing a full playthrough? I don't really have any plans right now. I just want to play for a little bit. So this is a sandbox game. Um, I remember there's a community center that you can technically complete. And that, I guess, is sort of completing the game, maybe. But in the end, it's a sandbox game. Um, so there's not really a... Ending. You know? There's not really a, a... You know, at some point, I guess you've technically finished everything. But I'm just gonna play for a while and... You know, sometimes they say this at the beginning of a 100 hour long playthrough, sometimes they say this at the beginning of a 4 hour playthrough. Um... We'll see. <clears throat> Until Diablo 4 comes out? Diablo 4 is coming out in like two and a half months. I would say that's a, a long time to commit to one video game, dude. I don't even think I'll play Diablo 4 for that much. Anyways, um, my name, Loco. What is my farm name? My farm name, okay. Uh, I'm already... Oh, there you go, buddy. Okay, so end of 2020, I did stream this game for a bit. That sounds about right. <sighs> the spawning pool farm? Only farms? Only farm. I don't know, guys. It's singular. Only farms would make sense, but it's only farm. Mm. Step farm? No, chat. Brenda's pool? The hatchery farm? Milo? 
Man, this is the hardest thing we've ever had to do, man. I gotta come up with a name for the farm. Boomer farm. Mm -hmm. I am much older now than I was in 2016, that's true. Boomer farm. Okay, sure. My favorite thing. What is my favorite thing, chat? Mm, apple? Apple? Cash? S subs? <laughs> wow, you guys have a really bad opinion of me, man. God, those are the first words that come to mind? Jeez. It's been a year. Hey, thank you very much, Bobby, for the one year. God, I'm a little offended, actually. My favorite thing, Jeffrey Bezos. Jeffrey Bezos is my favorite thing. My favorite thing is Sky Toss. Sky Toss is pretty great. I agree. Sky Toss is one of my absolute favorite things. Ooh, we can choose our farm. Our farm layout. Right, so this is one of the things I added to the game at some point. Uh, when I played, I think you could only pick standard farm. Courtless vacuums? Courtless vacuums are one of my favorite things. That is true. Highly recommend Courtless Vacuum Strip. Okay, so we have a standard farm? Nope. Riverland farm. Your farm is spread across several islands and scenic riverbanks. Fish are more common here than usual. The wood limits, or the wood slaughter, rather, limits your farming space. However, the bounty of the forest is nearly at your doorstep. A hilltop farm, a rocky terrain, and a winding river make it difficult to design your farm. However, a mineral deposit provides mining opportunities. Wilderness farm? There's plenty of good land here, but beware, at night the... Nope. The land is divided into four parcels, each with its own perk. Perfect for a group. So I'm playing solo. A beach farm, good foraging and fishing, and tons of open space. Sometimes the supply crates wash up on shore, however sprinklers don't work in the sandy soil. Nope, I like sprinklers. Um, I like the sound of the four corners farm, that sounds convenient. Hilltop sounds kinda cool. Forest also sounds cool. Any recommendations? Four Corners sounds very symmetrical, yeah. Four Corners is the, uh... German engineering farm? I mean, that is convenient. Hilltop is probably nice. I feel like Hilltop farms will probably look the best. Rocky terrain and a winding river make it difficult to design your farm. However, a mineral deposit provides mining opportunities. Okay, this probably has a lot of potential as far as good-looking farms go, but... Um... Okay, fine. The only bad one is the river farm? That sweaty gamer land? Okay. No, I don't really want to do rivers, man. The hilltop one involves a lot of walking? The forest one is good and balanced? Hmm. What's going on, Alex? Hello, hello. Man, I should have thought about this before I started the stream. Okay, let's do a uh, let's do a Twitch poll. You guys, you guys, tell me your brilliance. I will give you the options. What farm layout? So I can't change these after the fact. Um, so the first one is the forest forest farm. Second one is hilltop. That one I do like the sound of. Um, and then the four corners. I like the sound of that one, too. Alright, we have one minute to decide. I'm gonna go ahead and make my character in the meantime. I am the palest nerd. Oh god, I can be a very fancy color. I can be yellow. I'll go with pale nerd skin, there you go. Um... I don't know, guys. Did you change your hair color or your hair after you started up? I don't know. Um, I'll go with this one. That one looks kind of kind of normy. The normy setup. I can change my shirt. Um, that kind of looks like that shirt Rushy has. You know, that's the same color as his skin. We don't. No, no, no. We're not gonna run a shirt like that. 
I kind of like the the yellow one. The yellow shirt looked pretty good. Okay, this this one. Okay, I do also like kind of like this one. Yeah. What one, by the way? Well, you guys don't really make this easy on me, do you? Forest and hilltop both have the same amount of votes. God. Okay, well at least one of them fell off. Flip a coin. Do I have a coin? I might have a coin here somewhere. I have a coin. For the Americans watching, uh, coins. They're uh, used to... Um, currency is... It's not the gold stat, but like... It's okay. Uh, forest is gonna be heads. Hilltop will be tails, okay? You ready? I have not flipped a coin in a long time. Okay. Here we go, here we go. What is it? What is it? Stop looking at my forehead game. Ooh, it's tails. So hilltop? Hilltop it is. Perfect chat, thank you for making that so much easier. We needed to double pull it. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Hilltop it is, I already had it selected. Fantastic. Oh god. That is not the most convenient farming outfit. I don't think I want to wear a skirt. I'll just go with pants. I can have a beard? Ooh, do I want to have a beard? I can have glasses? Yo, I look like a baller with these glasses. I kind of look like low cool. Yo, can someone give me a low cool emote? I, I look exactly like low cool. Okay, I'll be running low cool, sure. That sounds about right. Uh, hair color, pants color, eye color, I, I, yeah. Oh, I can choose different kinds of pets. Okay, I definitely want a cat, because I have two cats. Even though dogs are pretty cool, too. This one's really cute, dude. This one, this one's really cute. Okay. Uh, so I've selected Hilltop, Rocky Terrain, and make- God, this is the hardest one, man. Why do you guys- <sighs> Okay, fine. Uh, this is not Santa, by the way. This is Grandpa. Grandpa has a really low quality bed. It sucks, dude. Anyways, and for my very special grandson. What's up, Grandpa? I want you to have this sealed envelope. Grandpa has a scimitar above his fireplace. What a legend. <sighs> no, no, don't open it yet. Have patience. Now, listen closely. There will come a day when you feel crushed by the burden of modern life. He's a slow talker. And your bright spirit will fade before a growing emptiness. When that happens, my boy, you'll be ready for this gift. Yeah. Now, let Grandpa rest. 20 years later. Work! 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 Join us! Thrive! I wish I could work at this place. Look at that guy. He's licking his lips the entire time. Oh, that's me! It's low cool. This is what it's like to live in an office. Or to work at, a, at an office, right? God, that's a gamer mouse. Apparently, I took my uh, my envelope from 20 years ago to work. Dear Loco, if you're reading this, you must be in dire need of a change. The same thing happened to me long ago. I'd lost sight of what mattered most in life, a real connections with other people and nature. So I dropped everything and moved to the place I truly belong. I've enclosed the deed to that place, my pride and joy, Boomer Farm. <laughs> it's located in Stardew Valley on the southern coast. It's the perfect place to start your new life. This was my most precious gift of all, and now it's yours. I know you'll honor the family name, my boy. Good luck. Love, Grandpa. P.S. If Lewis is still alive, say hi to the old guy for me, will ya? 
Here we go. So for those of you that are unfamiliar with the game, uh, the story is literally you inheriting a farm. That is literally the story of the game. Twenty years of property taxes? No, 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 no. Don't worry about that. Zero point five MI. Okay. It's probably something similar to AU. Strange, strange distance measuring tools. I don't, I don't know. Hello, you must be loco. I'm Robin, the local carpenter. Mayor Lewis sent me here to fetch you and show you the way to your new home. He's there right now, tidying things up for your arrival. The farm's right over here if you'll follow me. Is she single? No, she's one of the few people I think that's not single in the town. Yo, here's my hilltop farm, guys. Hell yeah. This is Boomer Farm. Dude, there it is. What's the matter? Sure, it's a bit overgrown, but there's some good soil underneath that mess. With a little dedication, you'll have it cleaned up in no time. There seems to be a hill above the hilltop. This is a very good point. Abdil brings up a good point, man. I don't know if this farm is now playable. There's a... How can I be on the hilltop farm if there's a hill above the hilltop? It makes no sense. And here we are, your new home. That'll be $3 million in property taxes. Ah, the new farmer. So that's Lewis. Welcome, I'm Lewis, mayor of Pelican Town. You know, everybody's, or everyone's been asking about you. It's not every day that someone new moves in. It's quite a big deal. So you're moving into your grandfather's old cottage. It's a good house, very rustic. Okay, that's good. Rustic is good. Rustic, that's one way to put it. Crusty might be a little more apt. Yo, Robin, shut the f Robin! Already getting roasted. Don't listen to her, Loco. She's just trying to make you dissatisfied so that you buy one of her house upgrades. I think I remember where she lives. That's a little creepy, but I, you know, I studied everybody that I um, know is living in the same village as me now. Um, I have put up cameras in their home. No, uh, anyways, you must be tired from the long journey. You should get some rest. Tomorrow, you ought to explore the town a bit and introduce yourself. The townspeople would appreciate that. What's going on, Mark Fang? Welcome, Attentator. You want to start your first playthrough? What farm is best? Probably the default one. Oh, I almost forgot. If you have anything to sell, just place it in the box over here. I'll come by during the night to collect it. Don't come by during the night, Lewis. I should have picked dog. <laughs> I should have picked dog. Okay. Here we are, guys. This is my place. Okay. Wuzzed. Okay, I can walk and run, and I can inspect things. A small crystal. Uh, I also got some parsnip seeds, okay. You received 15 parsnip seeds. Here's a little something to get you started. It would be a nice gesture, uh, gesture rather, to introduce yourself around town. Some people might be anxious to meet a new farmer. Yo. I don't know if I'm extroverted enough for that sort of thing, okay? I think I might just be sitting back in my own place instead. So you can play this game like a complete introvert, where you never meet anybody, other than like maybe an absolute limited amount of people. Um, alternatively, you can get married in this game as well. And one of the top rated mods for this particular game that I looked up is Polygamy, where you can apparently marry the entire town. You can... <laughs> I don't know how that works. But, um, yeah, you could have everybody, um, <laughs> in your own, um, I was looking at the different mods that are available, and most of them are gameplay improvements, but then there's the common anime ones, right, where every character that you encounter is an anime person instead. 
I don't know why. why the, and then there's apparently, uh, yeah, you can start your own. Uh, yeah. Anyways, right. So that's one of my quests now. Introduce myself to people. Don't really care about that. I'll be honest. If you want to become a farmer, you have to start with the basics. Use your hoe to till the soil. <laughs> chat, chat, no. Then use a seed bucket on the tiled or the tilled soil to sow a crop. Water every day until the crop is ready for harvest. Cultivate and harvest the parsnip. Chat, no, I don't even have to look at the chat. I know what you guys are talking about. I got an axe. I've got a hoe over here used to dig and till soil. A pickaxe. A sky tea. I love sky, sky teas. I can use the side as well. What's this, by the way? Um, what is this? I don't know. There's a lot of low-hanging fruits. Yeah, there are quite a few. Okay, let's have a look around my farm. So we got an upstairs area over here. Okay, this is where the farmhouse, I think, is gonna go eventually. Oh, there's a river as well. There's a little cave. Okay. I am not gonna rush anything, by the way. I know that there's people out there that try to complete everything by, like, the very first day. I could not care less. Well, I mean, I care a little bit, but I'm not gonna... Min-maxing a game like this kind of defeats the purpose in, in, you know, in my opinion anyway. So I'm not, I'm not gonna min-max anything. Um, I can use the axe. Moderate run? I can do a moderate run. Okay. I guess I'll get started with cleaning up the top section here, but let's look around for a little bit. Can I... Your axe isn't strong enough for that. Okay, I can't. There's a whole lot of trees around here. 8.30 in the morning, by the way, guys. I've already been cleaning up a lot of stuff. When's the last time you did gardening at 8.30 in the morning? Never. Never for me. Literally never. You need the axe that the TikTok axe guy has? I have not seen the TikTok axe guy in a long time, but I know who you're referring to. There's this guy on TikTok. Um, I think he's probably like, maybe like, you know, probably around my age. He's probably around 30 or so. And basically what he does is he wears button shirts and he cuts logs. That's all he does. And I think he assumes he's making educational content about how to chop wood or something. But basically his entire comment section is filled with the Karens and the Brendas of this world. They absolutely love watching this guy chop wood. Yeah, he, he's splitting logs all right. He, yeah, he definitely knows what he's doing. But maybe once upon a time, that wasn't the intention, you know? But yeah, it's mostly uh, thirsty middle-aged women that uh, respond to his... Uh, and it's pretty funny. Yeah. Okay. Um, so I think I'm gonna clear out this section right over here, and then we'll go from there. Is there a reason to keep grass? I don't remember. I think there was a reason. I'm just gonna clear it all out. He was informational before all of that? That's so funny. Oh, yeah, yeah, I think the animals eat grass. Yeah, yeah. Well, I don't have any animals. We'll get animals eventually. You can touch it as well, Loco, when you're gaming all day. No, no, I'm touching virtual grass. Oh, shit. Did you know with Jojo Membership Prime you can send money to your favorite Jojo Entertainment person? And if you spend enough, Jojo might even repair your town hall. Dude, Jojo sounds kind of sick, the neon. Mmm, thank you for letting me know. Okay, I have a limited amount of energy every day. Thank you, by the way, for the resub. So every action I do takes a little bit of energy. 
So I can plant parsnips in here. There we go. And then I have to water them. So I gotta make sure I do this on a daily basis, because otherwise they die. I know some plants die a little quicker than others. Um, when you don't water them. Yeah, but cutting down a tree apparently takes a lot of energy. Who would have thought? Okay. So, it's 1 p.m. And I've already finished my day job, guys. I can't do anything else. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Oh, you can have only a very limited amount of inventory. I forgot about that. What do I do with the X's? I don't remember. Do I throw it in the box? Is that the idea? Um, I'm gonna go ahead and I guess throw the fiber away. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I think I can sell this at the end of the day. I can also put it in a chest. Oh, when it's in there, I can't take it out anymore. Um, I can definitely make a chest if I remember how. I don't know how. But I know you can build stuff. Are we going to complain about the inventory system? Mm, not yet. Maybe we will. Oh, this is where I do crafting. Ah, gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. For me, 1 p.m. means it's time to watch someone on Twitch. Someone? Hello? Toxic? Hello? Um... To spruce up your floor. Oh no, I didn't mean to make a... Oh god. Well, um, that's... <laughs> Fantastic. Not what I wanted to make. Uh, I have now made... No, I have now made this. Can I at least write something? Oh, okay, 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 okay. Here we go. Ah, there you go. Flawless. Put up a little parsnip icon there. Fantastic. Uh, I will put this in the chest as well. Right, so I can still take out one item. God, I'm struggling with the uh, basics. How do I... Can I not put it in there? Oh, I guess you can't. It's going well so far, guys. Instead, I'll put a sign right next to the chest if I can. There you go. Um, I can uh, put an introductory... Uh, I, I can put an intro... Ooh, I can put my site on the sign. There you go. That way, Lewis knows he's no longer welcome here. Anyways, and just like real life, suddenly it's the end of the day. You're like, huh, what did I do? Nice glasses. It's a pleasure to meet you. I'm Harvey, the local doctor. Oh, he's also a nerd. Doctors, huh? Oh, I gotta be careful. I have very little energy. A stranger, my name's Vincent. Mommy says not to talk to strangers, but you seem okay. Vincent, no, listen to your mom. Grandma! No, I don't... I'm trying not to... I oh, I can give you stuff? Oh, hey, so you're the new guy, huh? Cool. Thanks, dude. Hey, kid. Name's Pam. Okay. My name's Sam. Good to meet you. Good. I am gonna run out of energy on my first day on accident because I keep using the wrong button. <gasps> I remember her! You know why I remembered her, guys? On my first playthrough, this is the lady I married. I did. We even had kids together and everything, man. Do you think she remembers? It's nice to meet you. You picked a good time to move here. The spring is lovely. Does Laura know about this? I think she does, yeah. 
Hey, Mr. Loco, uh, the new farmer. I'm Pierre, owner of the local general store. If you're looking for seeds, my shop is the place to go. Okay. Thanks, man. A little agriculture could really inject new life into the local economy. I, I think that was love at first sight. Yeah. Hello. Oh, I'm not enough good friends with Abigail to enter her bedroom. Okay. Don't care about you anyway. She's playing video games. What a nerd. Hello, you must be Loco, uh, the new farmer. I'm Caroline. My husband runs the general store here. Okay. Dude, these people have a huge place. What is this? They have like a shrine over here. You guys can't even see, I don't think, because I'm covering it with the... Uh, with my camera. Altar of Yoba. I thought it was Cyril, but yeah, no, no altar for Cyril over here. Um, so seasons in this game, much like real life, last 28 days. There's Lewis, Vincent, the Egg Festival, Haley, Pam, the flower dance. Okay. One season a month, man. And seven days only. It's very convenient. Oh, aren't you the one who just moved in? I am Maru? Yo, guys, is Maru single? I forgot that there's a character in this game called Maru. Finally, finally, I'll... I'll be able to get some more APM. You know, with a small town like this, a new face can really alter the community dynamic. It's exciting. Yeah, Maru. Altering the community dynamic, huh? What's up, Penny? Penny is always a chat, a chat favorite as well, yeah. Maru is a, it, wait, Maru is single and she's a nurse? I can marry Maru? Mm. Hello, I'm Penny. What's up, Penny? I can't talk anymore to Penny. Penny! Okay, well, no more talking to Penny. Okay, this is the beach, right? Yeah. Oh, we should sell these things. I forgot about those. Um, I don't know if I can still pick them up. Can I? Can I? No. How do I eat it? Yeah. We need to pick up these things. Ooh, dude. Yeah, yeah. So these things sell for a lot of money. I remember that. I don't need clay. Clay is for losers. There's a bridge. With 300 pieces of wood, this could be fixed. Are you insane? I have 22. Day's already out, guys. Everybody in Stardew Valley goes to bed at 8 p.m. Normies? I don't think normies go to bed at 8 p.m. But this place is called Boomerville, right? Or at least it's called Boomer Farm. So, yeah. Maybe I shouldn't be too surprised. Can I even go home? I have no energy. Dude, I literally cannot go back to my farm like this. Um, I also know that there's a maximum time that I'm allowed to be out for. Because otherwise I think my character falls asleep or something? Oh, it's 2 a.m.? Okay, okay. No, 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 I don't want to sleep on the streets. I can go to the bar? I don't want to go to the bar. Are you insane? There might be other people. 
Yo, Lathrinus, gifting five subs. Hell yeah, thank you, dude. Glad you still enjoy. There you go. Good. Thank you, Peter. Okay, we'll just go to bed early. Oh, it's a lamp. That's what it is. A fire hazard. That's what it is. I made 12 or 212 dollars on my first day, guys. That's not bad. That's really good. Your progress has been saved. There it is. I got mail. Advertisement? I keep finding cool stuff, but my backpack is full. Does this sound like you? Well, Pierre has got you covered. Stop by Pierre's general store today and check out our affordable size 24 backpack. See you soon. Hello there, just got back from a fishing trip. You should come down to the beach sometime. I've got something for you. Willy. This guy's parents really call him Willy. I need to get a backpack, guys. A Giga Chat backpack. That's that's the goal. I gotta make sure I plant all my seats. I have some mixed seats as well that I found. Perfect. This is exactly what farmers do in real life too every day, guys. Taking the watering cans and watering your broccoli. That's how it works. So for those of you unfamiliar, broccoli does not grow in the store. Did you know that? Milk does not actually grow in the carton. Or if you're in Canada, in the bag. It doesn't grow in the store. Yeah, yeah, insane, right? What's a broccoli? I don't know. Can you recover stamina just by being in bed, but not sleeping? No, I don't think you can be in bed without sleeping. Much like me in real life. I fall asleep right away. Canadian milk bags are bred in long tunnels? Really? Oh, I had no idea. Yo, Naroop, thank you. Welcome back. One more tree and then I'm gonna go down to the beach. No, my character looks like low cool. I've modeled my character after one of the Twitch chat emotes. That's supposed to be me looking cool. I don't know, I, I don't know, man. That emote looks better than me, that's for sure. Okay. I need some room. A stone? I don't need stones. Stones are for losers. Okay. I'm not a stoner. No, no, no. Maru! What up? Chat, we gotta act cool. Act cool, everybody. Act cool. Have you met my mom? She's the town's carpenter? Okay, she's inviting me to her mom. That's good, maybe? Maybe. Oh, 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 there's the nurse. That's Maru? Is that Maru? Muscle remedy and energy tonic. Oh, you can restore energy. Ah, right, 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 you can. I think I've already met her mom, actually. Yeah, I think the carpenter, Robin, is her mom. Hello. Sorry, I'm just doing my quest, okay? I gotta say hi to everybody. Hello? 
Willie, ahoy there, son. Heard there was a newcomer in town. Good to finally meet you. What's up, Willie? I'm still trying to unwind from a month out on the salty seas. It was a big haul. I sold a lot of good fish. Finally saved enough to buy me a new rod. Damn. Willie balling, man. Here, I want to give you my old fishing rod. It's important to me that the art of fishing stays alive. And maybe you'll buy something from the shop once in a while. Yo, Willie. Willie is smart. He knows I'm going to be a farming multimillionaire. So he's just uh, being polite right now, okay? This may seem strange that he's giving me free stuff, but... Even though we're strangers, this guy is just investing in the future. Yeah, it's literally bait. But it's the rot, not the... Anyways. There's good water here in the valley, all kinds of fish. Yeah, and now we continue fishing for the next six hours. My shop's back open now, so come in or come by if you need supplies. I'll also buy anything you catch. If it smells, it sells. That's what my old pappy used to say anyway. Fish not supposed to smell, Willy. If it smells, it sells. Mm -mm -mm. Okay, so he has got a large fish tank. Can be placed inside your house. A training rod? A bamboo pole. And trout soup. Yo, this guy is selling a, a rod for $500. Is that a lot? I don't know. Oh, he got me one for free as well. It's the same thing. Gunter can tell me more about this. Oh, right. Yes. The curator of the local museum might want to know about this. Right. I remember Gunter. Glass shards. Okay. Yeah, there's a lot of relics you can find around this, uh, around this place, man. So, I think those those shells and those things we looted in the previous day, they respawn here. So, I gotta go here occasionally. Yeah, there's more over there. So, I think one of our first orders of business is repairing this bridge. 300 pieces of wood. So, I currently have 77 here with me. I just need to cut down trees every day. It'll take a little bit, but we'll do that. Dude, look at that. The mayor has a car. Look at this chat over here. Balling with his massive house as well. He's got a truck. It, is that a truck? I guess it's kind of a truck. It's a small truck though. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Hello. This is Gunter right over here. Abysmal. Not a single piece in the entire collection. <laughs> this guy runs a museum without any items in it. He's a marketing genius, chat. Somehow he still makes a living. What's this? You found something? Let me see. <laughs> Remarkable. It's very old. I'd love to study this in greater detail, but it is yours. Yeah. It's mine. I've got a favor to ask you. Would you consider donating any new artifacts or minerals that you find? We could make a groundbreaking discovery together. Oh, and who knows? If you keep donating, I might come across something interesting. All right. Speaking of donation... No, no. To pr Prime! <clears throat> Think about it, will you? If you decide to donate, just bring the object to the front desk. Tips on v farming, use fertilizer to improve quality, reduce workload, and hasten crop growth. Fruit trees take a whole season to grow, but they require very little maintenance. Crops will die as soon as the season ends, unless they grow in multiple seasons, like corn. Some crops, such as kale and wheat, need to be harvested with the sky tea. Okay. Gunter asks if you consider donating. Right, Gunter, I've got some stuff already. You love corn? 
Yeah? Are you a corn hop frequenter? That's what I know about Iowa. That's the only thing I know about Iowa. Um, okay, so I, I have found some stuff, and I'll just put it over here. Hello? It doesn't seem like you have anything to donate. Yo, give me some free stuff. You, weren't you gonna give me free stuff? Oh, okay, I got $250. That's pretty good. El Toby! What's up? Thank you very much. Two years. Um, okay, so this guy sells me different items. Yeah, so he gives me better upgrades as well. It requires five copper bars, okay. So I'm gonna collect 300 wood to repair the bridge. So we can get some money. And then I think I need to check out Pierre's general store to see how much I... Uh, need to get that backpack upgrade. Inventory upgrade is always important, man. Always. Yo. This girl is blocking me, man. Get out of here. <laughs> 2,000 gold. Are you insane? Yo, guys, I think they're having a, a gym class over here. Yeah, inflation is wild in the Stardew Valley. $2,000 right now for a backpack is the norm. It's made out of Kevlar? I hope so. Oh, I should have actually sold some, or I should have actually bought some more um, seats. I don't know what time he closes, but I know he's closed some days, which is kind of annoying. So this is like the same as in real life too, guys. I found this out the other day, right? Turns out stores aren't open all the time. Now, usually I order everything online. And you can order anything online at any time. Um, but yeah, apparently not in real life. Cauliflower seeds takes 12 days to produce a large cauliflower. Takes six days to mature. Kale. Grass. Um. He also sells trees, but the trees are real expensive. Any suggestions, guys, what I should buy? I guess I'm gonna go for the most expensive. No, not grass. I'll get cauliflower. Okay, I'm broke. I am now a cauliflower main. Potatoes are the best money, Loco? Okay, well, I'm a cauliflower main, though. So, I should be able to still harvest this twice. I'm not gonna be able to plant it all today, but... Not bad. Um, how do I refill my bucket? Or, or my watering can? I don't remember. I think just at any water? Uh. My hoe didn't work. Hate it when that happens. Okay. Mm, 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 mm. What's going on, Sleepy Zealot? Yeah, this, I've been playing a lot of stressful games lately, man. I still have two boss fights to do in Dark Souls 3. So I have to do both the Nameless King. As well as... Um, the Ringed City DLC. I'm currently on the Demon Boss. And... Those guys are a pain. <laughs> So I figured, you know, let's let's alternate it with uh, something a little bit more relaxing. Can I refill my water over here? Yes. Mm 
Loco's getting older, he can't handle the stress anymore. This game is pretty stressful, to be honest. It, it, it looks nice and relaxing for you guys, but in reality, man... The Sister Frida fight went well, yes. I love the Sister Frida fight. The Sister Frida fight is actually really good. I uh, chose the cat pet, yes. Ah, <sighs> nice. Plus one axe proficiency already. Um, trees sometimes drop seed pods. Or seeds in general? Okay. I could also make a field snack. Okay. Our third day in the Stardew Valley. Well, I've wrapped up my second day. How much money did I make? $58. Pretty good, guys. Not as good as day number two, but... Or one? Yes. You hear that? It's raining, chat. You know what that means? We don't have to water our crops. Rainy days are the absolute best day. In Stardew. Okay, I don't know about real life. Um, usually not a huge fan of- oh, I'm watering my stones, I don't think I need to do that. Uh, in real life, usually rainy days, not as exciting. But in this game? Pull. Don't even have to water my crops. That's like 80% of the work. We'll clean up the farm a little bit. It's very British. Uh, they have rain in other countries too. Believe it or not. I think. I mean, I live pretty close to the UK, so... We get some of the leftover rain. Maybe there is no rain in other places. That could be. Stop lying, Loco. Okay, sorry. I didn't know. 